Hello everyone, hope you're having a great day today. Today we are going to be talking about the deluxe resorts at Walt Disney World. For the first one we have Animal Kingdom Lodge. Animal Kingdom Lodge you can see over a hundred different species of animals out of the window if you get that type of room. But don't worry, there is other places to watch the savannah. I have not stayed here but I would like to one day. I have heard the food is really good at this resort. The lobby has breathtaking views. The next resort we come to is the Polynesian Resort. The Polynesian Resort is across the lake from Magic Kingdom. This is the, our view from the concierge level lounge. The beds were comfortable and you can fit at least two people per bed. They also have the bungalows that you can stay in and they look really awesome. This resort is connected to the monorail. Then we come to the Disney's Contemporary Resort. This resort has the monorail entering the building. This resort also has an okay restaurant called Chef Mickey's, where you can meet some of the characters, but the food is just okay. You can get a lake view room and see the water pageant from your room. The Contemporary Resort is within walking distance from Magic Kingdom. Here we have the Beach and Yacht Club resorts. They are two different resorts, but most people group them together, so I am doing that as well. I have not stayed at either one of these, but hopefully one day I will. They both are within walking distance from Epcot and Hollywood Studios. They both are elegant, but feel casual for families. The Beach Resort has a pool that has sand on the bottom. It is the only pool in Disney that has that. Now we come to the Boardwalk Inn. It is within walking distance from Epcot and Hollywood Studios as well. And again, I have not stayed in, at this resort either. There are things to do at night on the Boardwalk itself. If you stay here, you have food options, and I mean options. The next resort is the most expensive resort on property. It is the Grand Floridian. It is gorgeous and elegant. Personally, I would not stay here only because I do not feel like I would fit in. There is an orchestra playing as you arrive. The monorail also goes through here, or goes to the Grand Floridian. Finally, we come to my favorite of the resorts at Disney so far, and it's the Wilderness Lodge. It's my favorite because I like the rustic atmosphere to it. It also has a restaurant called Whispering Canyon Cafe, and they make you laugh and have a great time while you're there. You can see true, true wildlife like deer at this resort as well. As a time of posting, all resorts of the Deluxe start at $363 a night. Please tell me your favorite Deluxe resort. Thank you for watching and have a magical day.